Good day everybody, this is Nelka Rock again and today we will answer one question from our friend Mr. JM. Mr. JM said, Hello Nelka, were you able to find out how to copy paste in the section view or is it po not possible in evil? Yeah, okay. How about arraying objects or lights in the section view? By the way, your website was giving me some serious spam, it seems. I tried three times, but I cannot go to your website without removing the spam warnings. Okay, uh, JM, this is how you will go to my website. Okay, you need to go to Nelka Rojo at, sorry, Nelka Rojo website. I will give you the link in the description below because I haven't renewed my... A website payment yet that's why it's still with Wix uh, logo on it okay so don't worry just go and uh, check the description below so you can access my website without spams okay so let's go back to your question and that is all about the section views all right so can we do that okay I have a small villa here and what we're going to do is we'll go to the section uh, sorry story one and then we will go to the view of right view or front view and then from here now it's complicated because there are so many things we will install an LED strip so it it's like we're going to have a vertical LED on the wall okay so let's, let's select the LED now Okay, so I will type strip here and let's see if I have LED strips here. Okay, now I have it here from LED CSC4. So what I'm going to do is I will select the draw line arrangement and I will say, for example, I want to have LED strip from top to bottom. And I'll say yes. And then, yeah, so that's what happened. It's gone. But if you go to the side tab, maybe it's there. Yes. And that is the problem with Evo because you cannot place um, luminaires in the section view. Yeah, maybe you can do in the outdoor. Yes, like what happened here. It goes to the outdoor. Or if you still want to do like this, you can still go and select it and drag it. Go to the plan view and drag it somewhere inside. Like how do you want to put it in your... Um, say for example, I want to place it here in your, um, indoor area. Okay. So now it's here. Okay. So unfortunately it's not possible. Actually you need to move it and, um, yeah, because it's going out. So let's go and try again. So this time what I'm going to do is I'll go to the kitchen and dining. So I'll be having a section that is not so crowded. Or maybe living room. Yeah, okay. All right. See, this is the LED that we installed. Okay, now what we're going to do is uh, we will go to copy and paste. So click it and then control C and then control V. Yes, you cannot do it also. But if you go to the plan view after you press control C and then go to the plan view and then control V, then yes, it's possible. But once but you need to go back to the plan view be before you control paste or control V because you cannot do it in the section view. Okay, very difficult. So what else is, um, how about arraying objects of lights in the section view? Yes, that's the same. So for example, I want to put a rectangular arrangement here and I will say, I want to have an LED like this. Yeah, it seems that it's okay, see? but it's still outside yeah it goes outside the building so again it's not unfor unfortunately yeah you need to move it again go to the plan view and then move and then move go to the plan view and double check again if it's inside and then yes so jm it's not possible to do it in the section view yeah you need to uh, select it from the section view and then paste on the plan view and that's how you can do it. Yes, you can do it in outdoor but not for indoor, okay? So for example, let's go to the uh, outdoor and we will arrange some luminaire here. Yes, it's possible. If we go to the rectangular, we can do it also. Okay, now my screen is messy because now those luminaires are 
outside the wall. Okay? So even I think in 3D view, you can do it, but it's for the outdoor. Yes, there you go. So if you're doing the facade lighting, it's good. But if you're doing interior lighting, that's a bad um, call. You cannot do it. Okay, so that's it for now. And um, if you have any more questions, just put your comments in the, sec the comment section and I will answer on you that. On my next video, I will discuss the um, uh, Dialux Evo 12 updates. And also on the weekend, I would like to invite you to attend to my 30 minute training or webinar about how you will charge your client for your design fee. So how are you going to measure your fee for your lighting design service? Okay, so go and check in my YouTube channel the link about this uh, little webinar. All right, so see you again on the next video.